Good morning, everybody. <laughs> so today we're going on a, a little adventure. We're actually leaving Korea, <laughs> but it's not what you think. We are not going to North Korea. That is actually, the whole DMZ tour is closed right now. Yeah, you can't go on like the JSA tour, which is the one where you actually get into the... The blue room? Yeah, the blue room. And so we decided we'd actually say that for next time we're in Korea. So instead, we're uh, gonna step on the country for a little bit. We'll explain it in a minute. After uh, two subways, a train, and a bus. Mm -hmm. We have made it to immigration. <laughs> we made it to immigration. So where are we going today? We are going to the Republic of Naminara. Nami Naminara, Nami the Republic of Naminara. <laughs> so this is a small micro state in mm -hmm. uh, Korea that's actually not a micro state at all. No. It's just a privately owned island. And they declared independence without trying to assert it at all, yep. simply for the sake of being able to charge people to go on the island. They even have their own flag. That's crazy. So I just came back from the visa office, got our visa to get in. It was uh, 20 like $6. Let's go, let's go catch this ferry. Yeah, it includes the ferry, so it's more like a really expensive ferry than it is an affordable visa. <laughs> and it looks like we just missed the ferry. thing in the middle of the Han River here is uh, the island. That's Nami. It is a five minute boat ride. It's the quickest, one of the quickest border runs we've done. <laughs> they even have their own currency and everything. It's supposed to be just like a very uh, interesting little island. You can take a zip line all the way to the island. That would be so much fun. Why didn't we do that? Because we can't afford it. <laughs> Here it is, the official entrance to the Naminara Republic. You're officially in there. After a very short and not bloody war, Naminara was able to uh, secede from the rest of Korea and form its own republic in uh, 2006. <laughs> so this island is actually really famous for being one of the main filming locations for a ton of K-dramas. One of them being Winter Sonata. Which is a real famous one, a real I guess. Famous one. My parents watched it. I haven't watched it. Have we you listened, watched it? Uh, no. But I've listened to the music. Yeah, it's we really listened nice. to the song before we came. Apparently, there's a very famous song. We listened to it before coming Just here. To set the mood for the day. So we should be able to rent bikes here to ride around the whole island. There's a lot to do here. A lot of it's really expensive. So I think we're just going to stick to the bike mm -hmm. and see as many of the of the cool spots as we can. Mm -hmm. It turns out everybody that we walk past is humming along to the song that they're playing on the speakers. This must have been a really famous K-drama. Mm -hmm. It's really peaceful, I like it. So we found 
found the bike rental place and they rent bikes by the hour and it's pretty pricey so to save money look who I found we're sharing a bike <laughs> just kidding it's the exact same price for uh for two of us on this bike then separate bikes it was about $13 for exactly one hour so we're gonna make the most of it and we're gonna ride around this entire island I think it's about three miles all the way around This really reminds me of the first like week or so in Vietnam when I would just hang out on the back of the bike and Chewie was driving and I was just taking in the view and taking some footage. <laughs> it's really nice. How you doing up there, love? Good. So Tia figured out pretty quickly that she doesn't necessarily have to pedal for the bike to move. That's how that's going. It's kind of like when we go kayaking. <laughs> oh I think this, this setup right here is ideal for me. So it turns out this island is really, really small. And yeah. an hour was way more than enough time. Yeah, we made that in like record time. It was great. It's such a fun way to see it though. Mm -hmm. Also, riding around the island, we noticed just how much this must be like the adventure capital of South Korea. Because mm -hmm. there's like boats all over the place, zip lines, bungee jumping. They have all kinds of stuff. Yeah, and on the island itself, they have like these little roller coasters and uh, like these little hammocks you sit in. They'll swing you around. It's kind of like a a little bit of a nature slash amusement park. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Do you want to go see what they have in the center of the island? Yeah. So right across from the bike rental place, we found these. Yeah, this is where this lady was steaming them in this big play oven pot thing that had wood fire smoke. They smell pretty smoky. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I got pumpkin. And I got, I think she said bean. Okay, you want to go? Cheers. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's oh, that's really good. Oh, the insides are bean and the outsides are different. It's way more savory than these things usually are. Yeah, it's not very sweet at all. I, ca I think I like it like that. Ooh, that's really good. That's not yours. Ooh, pumpkin butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> This is a very interesting island. There are little ah. unique things all over the place and like peacocks are running loose and there's... And bunny <laughs> rabbits back there. I saw some for, one. for ostriches, so we're gonna head that way because why, I mean ostriches. Oh, well, we found the ostriches. Sure did. I wish, uh, I wish they looked happier. They're missing a bunch of feathers and stuff. I think maybe this pen is too small for them. There's three, three, four, three. three in here. Yeah. Yeah, none of them look very happy. They look like dinosaurs. They look very odd, but such cool birds though. Yeah, really. This island has a little bit of everything. It really does. I don't know what to think of this so island. Fun. 
Yeah, the, uh, I think like you said earlier, it, it really feels like a theme park and a nature park in one. Mm -hmm. And it's a little unsettling to be honest. <laughs> well, not unsettling. It's just weird. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I don't know what to think about it. Mm -hmm. There's like a tank over here. Do you want to go look at the tank? Sure. There it is. Uh, so this tank was actually donated and it's a memorial to all those that lost their lives in the Korean War. Mm -hmm. It's really neat that they put that here. They're way bigger than I thought. The tanks? It's huge. <laughs> Tier for scale. <laughs> there it is. There's Tia. They are Cheers. To such a good day. Ending it with some Nami Island beer, of course. This place has its own brewery. <laughs> oh my gosh. And we walk by the souvenir shop and they have their own stamps. I mean, this place has got everything. And a hotel. It's like a know. whole different country. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I still can't get over that you can drink in public in Korea. A part of me feels like, like I'm about to get arrested or something. But yeah. I love how laid back Super nice. it is here. Yeah. That's a cool little uh, little republic over there. That was definitely way more fun than our last border run. <laughs> I'm really glad that we came. It was yeah. a good day. This flag is in my <laughs> face. That was oh. good. And you guys, you know that we do a postcard in every new country that we visit, so... so since this technically was a, a different country, we got a NAMI specific postcard. You guys know the drill. If you like this postcard, comment down below. We'll pick a random winner in a few days and uh, we'll send you uh, a little notification. Yeah. I'll see you guys. We just wanted to say um, it's been a year since we started this vlog. Yeah. Um, I mean, we just started filming on our cell phones. And we way still back do. In Greece, so we still do. And uh, we just want to say thank you. I mean, people actually want to watch some of our videos and that's, that's really cool. So thanks for coming along with us on this whole trip, you guys. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, here's to year two. We'll see you guys in the next one. See ya. Subscribe. All of these say hello or welcome, except for Canada is just, I love Canada. We must really love Canada. What else were we going to say? Um, oh. Oh, wow. Where did Chavio go? I can't see him. I'm wearing a green shirt. How close is too close to a peacock? Pretty close. Is it weird that I'm getting nervous? Oh, I thought he was going to poof. I don't know, that would have been so cool. It, it <laughs> looks like that. No. Okay.